KO Photonics Research Institute, KPRI, is an institution of KO University, led by Professor Yasuhiro Koike, where he serves as the director and carries out R&D on photonics polymer materials, such as graded index plastic optical fibers, GIPOF, and novel functional films for real color displays, among others. Koike is the inventor of GIPOF, highly scattering optical transmission polymer, zero by refringence polymer, among other photonics polymer materials. This is the world's fastest plastic optical fiber, GIPOF, capable of delivering 40 gigabits per second over 100 meter distances. And a latest discovery called error-free POF was recently proposed, which eliminates the need for the error correction technologies in data centers. When I proposed the graded index plastic optical fiber at the time, people, even including myself, supposed that the plastic optical fiber is inferior to the glass optical fiber. The glass optical fiber can transmit the signal for 100 km without any amplification technologies across mountains and connecting cities. On the other hand, the plastic optical fiber can cover only a few hundred meters. However, passing 30 years since then, very recently, we've made very important discovery. That is the error-free plastic optical fiber. We have positively utilized the light scattering to increase and control the mode of mixing through the plastic optical fiber. That has dramatically reduced the bit error rate of the data communication. Low noise data transmission is crucial for imaging high speed data communications, such as in data centers where multi level modulation is being introduced. In conventional glass fiber optics, transmission quality deteriorates with even slight misalignment of the fiber. However, the error free plastic optical fiber achieves much more stable data transmission without the need for precise fiber alignment and connection. KPRI has started an R&D collaboration with Nito Denko Corporation for GIPOF fabrication. The first products of the active GIPOF cable were just launched by Nito Denko Corporation in February 2023. KPRI initiated a national funded research project called Innovative Communication System by the Error-Free POF Technology in 2022 as part of the Beyond 5G R&D Promotion Project of NICT based on the R&D policy of the Ministry of Internal Affairs and Communications in Japan. By utilizing the error-free plastic optical fiber, the error correction widely used in the current data center is no longer needed, which significantly reduces the energy consumption, time delay, and cost. Optical fibers have a high noise tolerance and can achieve high data rates, so there is a need to use them as run cables in control systems, such as robots, spacecraft, and automobiles. However, Conventional glass optical fibers were unsuitable for such systems because they are weak in bending and crack easily upon impact. On the other hand, POC has a great advantage of being tolerant of them and generating almost no errors. So we have been researching and developing codecs, transceivers, network controllers, and system-on-chips. That takes advantage of the characteristics of POF. KPRI and Professor Kuike apart is the emphasis on understanding fundamentals of polymer systems and their insights into applying those fundamentals to make practical technologies. I'm confident that KPRI and Professor Kuike will be major contributors to polymer photonics technology in the years ahead. So the error-free plastic optical fibers can have a really big impact on data centers. But think about what other things it's gonna have an impact on as well. That's what gets me excited. 
today. We have much bigger files. A lot of these things are up in the cloud. We've got large files on our phone. That's gonna all become much, much faster, which I think that's really exciting and opens up a new possibility of things that we're gonna be able to do it, um, creatively. The error-free graded index plastic optical fiber and photonic polymer for real color display have been created for the next Beyond 5G society. Our challenge is material changes the system.